Hi guys, um, this time I'm going to show you guys how to set up a wireless printer. Um, the first thing you'll need is you will need a router that has built in print server capability. Now this is my router that has the ability uh, DSL 2750U uh, D-Link. Okay, so that's the first thing you'll need. This is the most important part. The second thing is you will need a working printer. Okay, a working printer means it must work when it is directly connected to a computer. Okay, so the model I'm going to use is MP145 uh, Canon Pixma, but it works on any printer. This is a multifunctional printer. It has a scanner, copier, and printing. But once I set it up for wireless, the only feature that will work through that remote computer is the printing feature only but I can still copy and scan if I plug it out and connect it directly to my computer so what you do is turn the printer on it's on and then connect it to the router directly this is the USB port connected straight into the router okay and then give it a moment and you will notice this you will notice that the USB light lights up okay once that's done then I'll head on to my computer and show you what to do there okay guys um, so once you're on your computer go to start and put in CMD and then choose IP config and hit enter then what you have to notice is the default gateway 192.168.1.1 okay this is my IP address on my network okay uh, keep that in mind 192.168.1.1 it will vary uh, between different networks that means uh, your IP address or your default gateway would be different but it could be the same as well okay then open a browser you can use uh, Firefox or Internet Explorer or anything. Then type in that IP address into here. And you'll be brought to this page. This is the model I mentioned to you earlier. Just follow your user guide. It should be in there. And for the valid code, just rewrite this. Okay, we are in. Okay, then if you notice on your left here there is print server. Right, yeah. Make sure that this is checked and printer make and make model. Okay. Uh, this is my model, so I've typed it in. Uh, because I might be using two or three different printers, so I made the uh, name very specific. MP145 or Canon MP145. Okay, and then hit save, apply. Okay, once that's done, then you can close your browser and go to device and printers. Click add printer, add a network or wireless, and then choose this. The printer that I want isn't listed. Okay, okay, this is important, guys then put in http semicolon slash slash 192.168.1.1 okay this is the address of my default get gateway then dlink has set a default extension for printers which is extension 631 slash printers with an s slash Canon MP145 this is the name that we assigned for our printer just now okay then go to next okay now choose your printer make my one is a Canon MP140 series I know it's MP145 but it is under the series of 140 then choose OK
I'm not shortening this video to show you exactly what's happening. Okay. Uh, you've successfully added, right? Then hit next. Set as default printer. That's up to you. And I'm going to print a test page. I'm printing a test page. And it's gone. And it's printing. If you can see, my printer is connected to my router here. Okay, here it is. Now, uh, right, that's that's our setting just now. And take a look at this print uh, printer name. This is what we uh, typed in just now. Okay, like uh, as you've seen, uh, it has printed, so you can close this and hit finish and this is the printer okay that's it this is the gap toss for youtube